Rethink Robotics, we're building robots which are meant to let people increase their productivity by letting ordinary factory workers control the robots, train the robots, interact with the robots. So it's, it's giving them a tool, just like the, the PC gave office workers tools, didn't get rid of office workers, but changed the jobs they were doing. Baxter is a, is a platform. Um, the software is separate from the hardware platform, so the software platform will support other robots ultimately. Right now we're concentrating on a few uh, verticals within production, uh, plastics manufacturing, third party logistics, etc. We'll be opening that up as new software comes out, the robot gets more capable. But we've also just recently started shipping the robot to universities. Now we've got a con user con community out there building more stuff for Baxter. And you know, some of it's going to be sort of a little wacky, but there's going to be some kids out there who come up with some ideas that we would never have thought of in a million years. And we're going to say, oh yeah, that's really good. And, and that's what happens. You know, we're, we're at hundreds of users now. Um, we'll be getting to thousands of users developing code. And I'm really excited about what they're going to come up with. Well, I already see um, the impact of the maker movement on my own robotics business because we put robots out in the small companies. They want to build specialized hands, uh, grippers, for the things they're manipulating. They often go to a, a tech shop and do 3D printing of fingers and put them on their, on their robot. So there's a sort of a, a connection between the maker movement and these more flexible robots. You know, we build something that's general purpose and then it needs to be specialized so the maker movement specializes it. So I see, I see that things going back and forth. A few people have talked about, let's start putting some Baxters in tech shops so people can start doing it the other way around, have the Baxter help with products of 3D printing. I think we're gonna to start to see that. Mm -hmm.